Hey, what's up everybody? Hi, Stevens here. Uh, this part of the video here uh, is uh, for Dakota. Um, I'm standing right here in front of the Buffalo here. It's a brand new truck. Got a lot of work I'm gonna be doing to it. Got a trailer I'm gonna be picking up later on this week. But, uh, hey man, I got some caps for you, man. I got uh, one of them says Peterbilt. Let's see. That one says Peterbilt Rush Truck Center. And then the other one, Rush Truck Center. So I got these coming to you. I'm going to drop them off at the St. Christopher's Fun booth at Gats this year. And uh, yeah. So hope you like them. Anyways, on with the video. just out there um, uh, unbraiding my uh, my electrical and airlines um, back there because they were touching the catwalk and I was going to get some slack out but I had to unbraid them to do it which would suck because I like the braid I'll probably go braid them back but I don't know like how to braid I'm sure I can figure it out but um, that's like something my wife knows how to do. Um, as you, I don't know if you can really tell in the shot yet. I haven't looked at it. But um, back in the end of this dock here was, um, I think it would have been really easy. And it is actually pretty easy in a Freightliner or a uh, Volvo. And it'll probably be pretty easy once I really get used to this hood sticking out there. But uh, probably what y'all didn't see in the shot was the front of the, um, in front of my hood was a bunch of poles. Now, tr trucks I drive like hitting poles. Just kind of saying, uh-oh, watch calling. Um, I better get that. All right. My, my door shut, seal back on for the uh, next load. Um, our next load, next stop. We got two stops on this one. We got one stop off going uh, just south of uh, Richmond, Virginia, and, uh, and get the rest of it off. So that's what I got. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Big trucking. Okay. Flip-flops. Can you imagine that? What kind of truck driver? 
wears flip-flops to a customer. I don't know. A lot of people are going to say, well, I wear flip-flops all the time. They're comfortable. They may be comfortable, but they're seriously unprofessional. So this guy's over here training, backing up and stuff. I'm here at the uh, White's Travel Plaza Truck Stop, whatever, Petro here in Rafine, Virginia, and uh, parked over here on the back. Well, there's some couple nice trucks over here. See over there? And then, uh, then right over there, some really nice trucks. I figured I'd park back here in the back, right? <laughs> kind of do that. Uh, Y'all probably glanced and saw my coax hanging down. I don't have my radio plugged in yet. I know. It's, um, there we go. It's a daggum shame, right? So, um, I'm going to go inside here and take a shower uh, and go take a look around in this chrome shop I keep hearing about. So, let's go do that. You know, if I had a truck stop, like if I owned one, I would call it the Hoods Truck Stop. And I would only allow hooded trucks in the truck stop. Like mine and his, but not Warner's, no. guy backing up there hell yeah but not that one hell no anyways I'm gonna go get a shower um, take a look at this uh, chrome shop how about it Specter that wasn't much of a chrome shop all right I got a problem Oh, they got those. Dr. Pepper. Where is the daggum Dr. Pepper? Oh, down here with the Pepsi stuff. Ugh. I feel like a Democrat. Ugh. Never have a flag here. Oh, it's racist. See, this is a chrome shop right here. That's all you get. That's it. That's all you get. I'm like, man. I was hoping there was more. I was looking forward to that, but. Uh, got a bunch of, uh, who is that? Diesel Life. Um, I saw Big Rick T's in here and Hammer Lane. So, but that's all I saw, those three. But anyways, see, you can kind of see in there. It's just Hammer Lane. I was hoping to see um, like Stay Loaded or something. <clears throat> There's more Hammer Lane and Diesel Life right there. Listen, you gotta build your stuff for the big man. All right, I'm tired of all these clothing companies making making um, freaking clothes for uh, for midgets okay man look at those clouds Isn't that cool it's pretty awesome that would slow down oh Werner's in a rush okay I'm thinking is this the chrome shop right over here? Exercise room. That can't be it. That is a regular shop. Oh, they got some chrome in there. Let's go check it out. Let's go in here. Parts and service center here. I'm gonna go in here anyway. There's some chrome in here. Let's go check it out. Yeah. 
got a uh, something like that uh, hood ornament for the uh, for the hood. Here's some um, stacks. These are those eight inches. I think so. Two ninety nine. Just for those as tips. One of the things I'm thinking about getting is uh, another steering wheel. Um, something, something like over here. I don't know which one I get. I think the the the, the ones with the skulls kind of look cliche, and then the you know the girls on it. I think those look cliche, but one of these clean things right here. I kind of like this one kind of racing feeling with the, with the with the holes in it so I'm also looking at um, oh 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 this this is right here these is how I kind of want to to my step oops these right here is how I want to do my stacks right here. See how they kind of curve out like that and curve out to the side. So these are what I have now, but the ones that kind of go up to the side, those are the ones we'll get. Kind of like the one with the, with the circle around the Peterbilt right there on the back. I think those actually look pretty good. That one. I like that one. That one looks pretty sweet. Of course, I would probably um, do dual revs with that instead of so so like you know just flip the switch and just turn purple. Let's see what else we got back here. The guys on the um, live feed were sitting there telling me to get some of those. I, I'm just not a fan of those. Here's a gear shift knobs, some extensions. I'll probably definitely do something, just not too, too, uh, not too much. And oh, look at this! I like this. Look at this. It's a, this is a for your steering wheel. That look like a gun barrel thing. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. Um, look at this bad boy. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. It's a 389, all chromed up, looking good. Saw it a while ago, backing in. There's a, oh gosh, freaking rain. There's a, um, I don't know if you can tell. Oh, there is a nice uh 379 with the w9 right next to it that w9 sitting way down low you look at that bumper you know i was sitting there saying a while ago that uh should make a truck stop it's like hoods only and i know a lot of you guys are sitting there saying oh ike's got the big head and you're right i do but it's like i don't know man um, like I said, I never forget where I come from, but I sure do enjoy the hoods. Of course, I'm all sarcastic and everything anyway. Whew, it's rain. It's not too bad. Oh, who do we got parked next to me? Someone wants parked next to me. Oh, look at this guy with this pretty truck. I'm going to park next to him and annoy him. He doesn't have a hood. Guys out of the hood parking next to me. Who do they think they are? There's a nice one right there. Of course, some idiot wants to. Well, both of them are nice. I like the red one. Of course, you know, some lazy idiot wants to park nose in. See, you know, I don't get this. Pure laziness, right? I don't like that. There's pure laziness. Have some pride in you, right? I mean, in everything. But like this guy, he's got pride. But anyways, 
don't take much it's not that hard to back up oh yeah oh yeah you see what i see that's what i'm talking about man it's gonna look good with that black trailer yes sir it is going to look good with that black trailer behind it look at that uh cab over shoot yeah man look at this sucker that's what i'm talking about who in the world to put those kind of lights on a daggone truck who in the world would go do that isn't it beautiful and it's dirty too that's the thing beautiful beautiful truck one thing that i'm gonna get in here for the inside it shouldn't take um should cost too much is get some um colorful lights for in the inside um seems like everybody and their mom does blue um remember i had blue when i had the um the cascadia and that's that's all nice and all but everyone's doing it so i don't know what i want to do i've already done red red everybody has red i don't know if pink will really stand out in the videos but i'll get something i get something a little differently or a different a little different but um anyways we're headed to uh, missouri with this load this load i showed y'all a while ago um my cat scale here um, 79.820 on a load that's supposed to be, where's my weight? I saw it. Oh, 42,860. So if you guys haul in these, these peats like this, like life is good, whoever else, if you guys are, um, hauling these trucks, is that a, is that a pretty good, um, estimate like is that as pretty much as high as you want to go is about 43 um leave a comment if you want to um but yeah i mean I, now i fueled up right before i took that 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 ticket first heavy load so the the weights could be off you know at the ship or whatever a lot of times they those numbers are either you know good or bad numbers who knows but anyways i'm on my way man i got a freaking haul tail tomorrow i am uh 919 miles away from where i'm delivering and um i gotta be there not tomorrow but at eight o'clock the next day eight o'clock in the morning so let's just say i gotta hump it tomorrow and then We'll be getting up early in the morning and early the next morning to get it there so and then it's the quest to get back uh get this trailer dropped off and then go pick up the black trailer which is going to look awesome i'm going to be posting a lot of pictures on instagram so if you're not following me on instagram go follow me there especially with new truck anyways all right i'm gonna drink this chocolate milk sit here and think about it for a little bit and i'm going to go hit the t hit the sack that's right anyways hope y'all enjoyed it watch truck stop uh specter james i was wrong chrome shop yeah chrome shop still could have been a little better but it was a lot more to that next to the shop so is it an iowa 80 or four states no but What can you do? Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, we'll bring you more of the buffalo. Talk to you guys later. 73.